The remains of the structures of Stoppy Garden at Gudu Apus District, allegedly pulled down by the authorities, are still visible for all to see. The owner, Ngozi Anene, in tears, says despite order of the High Court of the Federal Capital Territory restraining officials of the Federal Capital Development Authority, FCDA, from invading the garden and park, that the officials moved in with their bulldozers and demolished the structures against a judgment of court. I was in the garden. They came and marked the place for demolition. I was not served any notice. I rushed to their office this morning, gave them a copy of the appeal and a copy of the motion that was served, which they've already acknowledged. And they have a copy in their office the 10th of this month. This morning I was in the garden, they came and demolished the place without even allowing us to pack anything out. So I want the federal government to intervene for me. I don't have anybody. Plaintiff counsel, who displayed court papers against the demolition, condemned the alleged actions of the FCDA authorities, saying that the officials did not obtain any stay of execution from court before demolishing the structures and that an appeal has been filed at the Court of Appeal against the action. So it's, 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 it is an affront on our democracy. We are not in a military dictatorship where self-help or the rule of force, we have a rule of law. Things are done properly in a proper democracy. It's unfortunate. Government will have to pay further damages for this which attempt made to get the reaction of the FCDA was not successful, but the structures are still in shambles while the matter is still pending in court. Basil Okafor, Court TV News, Abuja.